G'day guys, Sci-Fi back again with another action figure review. Hey everyone, how you all been? Uh, yeah, so finally, 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 I managed to get six inch Black Series of Cobb Vanth. Absolutely stoked. Been, this thing has been held back, held back, held back, held back. <laughs> there we go. That's a great representation of Timothy Oliphant. Mandalorian, what are we? Number 18. Jesus, heaps now, isn't there? How cool. You can read that if you want about the Marshal of Mos Pelgo and whatnot. What a great character. Even though he was pretty much all stitched up by Cad Bane, I doubt it very much. I reckon you're back. He only got shot once these days. People come back. All right, so look at the figure. So yeah, don't mind the new background. It's not new to me. It's my, my lounge room. The reason I'm not filming downstairs in my beer cellar is because it's too bloody cold. We'll talk about that as we go along. Look at this, how cool. That does look like Timothy Oliphant a little bit, yeah? I like it. It's an older figure, but it checks out. Very cool. Hmm. Also, if my brother and my mother are watching, there you go. It's a mini-me. Yep, yeah, my folks, my family, and my wife to a certain extent. And a couple of friends reckon I look like him. A little bit. Without glasses, of course. I, mean, I don't know, you can't see him in the background, that's good. So there we go. And I love it. Yeah, we all know Cobb Vanth managed to score Boba Fett's armour. It's not in good condition, yeah, from the Sarlacc. Yeah, this is really good. I'm not going to move him around a lot. He doesn't stand too well. He's a bit, a bit wobbly on his feet. And he will be again when I put all these accessories on. Got him here. Yeah, we go. All oh, right. Yep. So then let's, let's move it over. Start off backpack, which he does use. Again, sort of scratched up. And a different kind of missile. I'd say he's probably made that himself, yeah? I don't know if it clips in, probably does. Let's have a look. Are we keeping the missile on his back? Come on, get in there. Uh, right. Yeah, sort of stands there. Let's see if he stands up with it. No, absolutely not. Take it off for the time being. All right, let's not dig around. Fix it up later. Yep, comes with, I knew it, a rifle. This looks like it's been, yeah, wrapped up in bandages for some reason. Yeah, repaired. There's no other color on it really. Little, oh, little bit of a paint dodge up there. A pistol, which we have seen him use. Oh, what's that little bit there? Why is that little bit there? Oh, I don't know, maybe it fits into I don't know, there's absolutely no reason to be there. Maybe it's a, I don't know. <laughs> Fuck you. Yeah. Anyway, also the helmet, Boba Fett's helmet, of course. That, yep, the visor comes down, which is good. A little bit rubbery, but they all are. And of course, looking really worn out, thanks to the Salax guts. Yep, gastric juices, lovely. Yeah, that's what it does to metal, what it does to people as well, I guess. So there we go. Yep, so glad to get him, absolutely stoked. All right, yeah, and as you can guess, I'm in my, not in the beer cellar anymore, I'm in the lounge room. Stand up for God's sake, thank you. So yeah, I know it's very reflective and whatnot, um, reason being, downstairs is like minus two degrees, easy. You know, feels like, you know, with the wind chill factor and whatnot, the weather is absolutely shizer. Shocking out there, I'm not doing any, any videos down there for the time being. So I'll be up here and that'll be about it, I guess. All right, so yeah, glad I've got him and more coming on the way. And also, just before I go, Got a package 
point. So, who it's Oyster Will from IB 3D Customs. A little bit dinged. A bit spooked about that because it's extremely fragile. It has three pieces in it. Hopefully. Hopefully not more. All right, so there we go. So yeah, I've had a couple of days off. And because I've been crook, I'm better now, I reckon. I was gonna take the whole week off, but I'll give work a call later on this afternoon and see if I can come back or not. My position's been filled for the rest of the week. Anyway, enough of that. Let me know what you think. Let me see if it's in your neck of the woods, if it's in your EB, Zing, whatever store in this in Australia and the in New Zealand, if it's the Darth Rock, let me know. Middle-aged Kiwi toy collector, let me know if you guys are into this, if you want to get one. I really dig it. Yeah, I was worried it was going to, because it's been, it's been, it was made a few years ago now, but, uh, yeah, it wasn't going to hold up like some of the newer ones, but it does hold up very much indeed. All right. Again, very impressed. All right, guys, got another one coming up. You'll soon see what it is. I um, can't wait to open the box. What's in the box? All right, guys, sci-fi out. This is the way.